Incredible news. The first Hmong gymnast representing Team USA in the Olympics, Suni Lee, now has gold, and it's inspiring athletes around the world and here at home. Here's Local 5's Eric Richards. Family, friends, and fans of gymnast Suni Lee excited she scored the gold medal at the Tokyo Olympics. Local athletes at Ultimate Fusion Athletics in Menasha are taking notice. Seeing diversity on that team and, you know, really representing well. She's done such a great job just being a rock for that team and, you know, showing the strength of, you know, the Asian community. Lee's win is a symbol of progress and representation for the Hmong community. I definitely wish that there was more of it, um, but I think this is a really great step forward and I think the Hmong community is going to start to be represented more now. The instructors at Ultimate Fusion Athletics are encouraging their athletes to get to the Olympics one day, but they're also encouraging them to get a college education. If they want to do it for fun, they want to make it to college, then if they want to make college, that's the route that we try to take them and we work hard to try to get them there. 14-year-old Addison Schmidt is thinking of taking the college route. Olympics is usually harder skills and is a team of five girls representing the country and college gymnastics usually is a team just representing a state. The unofficial theme here, dreams can come true. I feel excited for whoever does it or whichever team it is, and it makes me want to be one like them one day. SUNY Lee leading the way for a diverse group of athletes, one balance beam at a time. Eric Richards, Local 5 News. Simone Biles, who dropped out of the competition and who so often SUNY would finish second behind in competition, tweeted out immediately about her teammates' performance. It said simply, congrats, princess.